that time, folks, we are back again with a Let's Play of Burial at Sea, Episode 2. Just released today. <clears throat> this is a blind playthrough, just like the last one. Uh, I have not heard anything. I have actually actively avoided. Um, and yes, Mr. Robot Animatronic, I will get to it. Give me just a second. Uh, I'm going to keep these episodes at about 20 minutes. And let's watch the previously. They told me, son, you were born to do great things. They okay. were right. Yeah. Okay. We played the first game. I'm Atlas, and I aim to keep you alive. You think that's a child down there? She's a little sister now. Somebody this is kind of a nice a sweet baby girl into a monster. Recap. It's Ryan! Goddamn Andrew Ryan! Head to medical! Would you kindly get this? Would you kindly find that? Would you kindly find that? Spoilers, by the way, for the first game. Would you kindly head to Ryan's office and kill the son of a bitch? Granted, did that airplane crash? Spoilers for a seven year old game. Was it Eight year old? 2006, I think. There ain't no Atlas, kid. The name's Frank, Frank Fontaine. Fontaine. Yeah. I had you built. I sent you topside. I called you back, showed you what you was, what you was capable of. Even that life you thought you had, that was something I dreamed of. You saved them. So we're going with a good ending you gave then. them the one thing that was stolen from them. A chance. They look like little monkeys. Okay, so... That's what happened in the first Bioshock, just in case you forgot what little sisters and are and who Frank Fontaine is. Uh, I always go on medium. I, I just watched that note. Alright. I'm excited. Here's hoping this is not as short as Episode 1 was. Episode 1 was great, except for the fact that it could be... be I think, what did I beat it in? Like an hour? Two hours? Something like that? Tops? Yeah, that's... That's no good for anybody. Hopefully they learned from that mistake. No, you're not. But you're about to be. There's the ending of the first one. Ooh, did we get some backstory? Nice. <gasps> did she make it to Paris? Yes. Quel est votre nom? Elizabeth. Elizabeth. Oh, she made it to no, Paris. I, I, I couldn't. I, I can't accept. Je vous en prie. J'insiste. Oh, thank you. I'm all, I'm all choked up now. Bonjour, mademoiselle. Salut. I want to take the gardening shears and start stabbing people. Okay. C'est bon. Merci. Uh, Alright, so I have very little control. Bonjour, Mademoiselle Elisabeth. Je manque d'inspiration aujourd'hui. You've got all of Paris to paint. Shut your hole. Oh, look, the little creepy kids from Bioshock Infinite. Bonjour. Um... Everybody's so friendly here. Bonjour, mon ami. Alors, tu as parlé à la jolie petite américaine? Oh, bonjour, mademoiselle. Salut. Okay, so I, I can't run or jump or anything right now. All I can do is walk slowly, but that's quite all right, because... Oh, I love taking in the sights. That's, what, that's why I love Infinite. You know, it's just... Bonjour. Aw, oh, pretty lovebirds. Oh, what do we 
gars. Vin rouge, vin blanc, croissant, crêpe à sucre, croque monsieur. Totally took high school in French, or French in high school. Oh yeah. I'm gonna pretend that I could read that because I took French in high school. Okay, that's it. That's the problem. The only problem I have with Bioshock Infinite is it looks fucking gorgeous until you look up close. Because, yeah, that, that plant is kind of janky. It's not as bad on PC. Uh, I played the free one uh, when it was on PlayStation Plus on the PS3, and oh my god. Holy shit, did they cheat. Like, even still, you can see the... the fl Why am I showing you this? You guys know the graphical cheats. Ça va bien? Oh, God. There, no, see, look. Look at this. Those are just, like, bumpy, cheap... Never mind. All right. Oh, man, it's so pretty, though. I'm, and I'm so happy Elizabeth got to go to Paris. Ooh, give me all the cheese. I love cheese. Bonne journée. Comment ça va, Elizabeth? This is like Disney version of Paris. Like, look at this. Pink Bonjour. birds and... That's okay. She... For all that she's been through, Elizabeth deserves it. Et si tu venais boire un verre avec nous? Sois pas jalouse, ma petite. C'est pas interdit. Don't be jealous. It's Elizabeth. Everyone loves Elizabeth. Viens jouer avec nous, Elizabeth. I'm sorry, Cassette. Next time, I promise. Ah, creepy French clowns. Bien le bonjour, mademoiselle. And little devil bunnies, because that has glowing red eyes. Is Sander Cohen gonna come fuck everything up? Yeah, this is like Paris a la Disney. This is... Oh, the library. Because Elizabeth is basically just a glorified bell. <laughs> really? Did they, they just went there. It has not been written yet. Comment allez-vous? Aw, oh, look at the little baby worm. Une baguette, mademoiselle? Omelette du fromage. Bonjour, Elisabeth. Omelette du fromage. Omelette du fromage to you too. Aha, omelette du fromage, monsieur. Ah, yes, oui, omelette du fromage. Please tell me he just stops and throws up. Ah, oh, do you have omelette du fromage? Eat your heart out, Walt Disney. Oh 
Why did France suddenly get creepy? Oh no. Oh no. Oh, that's the Lutess. Oh no. Sally, wait! Come back! Come, Come back, out. Mr. Bubbles! Auntie M! Auntie M! It's a twister! Sally, stop! Come back! <laughs> Sally, where are you going? It wrenches. Oh. oh, and a weeping angel. No, no, wrong, sorry, wrong fandom. Where did she go? Yes, I know, that's the Statue of Columbia. And the road just stops. Alright. Zoro was here. Go away. It wasn't my fault. I didn't do anything. No. 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 It wasn't my fault. I never should have left. I never should have left you there. What did we learn? What's the holdup? Just having a bit of a laugh, Atlas. Wait, this what? ain't a sporting event. Put a bullet in her. Okay. No need to torture the poor girl. We're not animals, you know. All right, all right. Let her go! Quiet down, dear. In a minute, all your problems will be over. Elizabeth, tell him you can get him back. Booker? I don't understand. I How? Say, I can get you back to Rapture. What? Just say it. I can get you back to Rapture. Put the gun down. Now. Wait, then where are we? What was that you said about Rapture? I can get you back to Rapture. And how you plan on doing that, sister? You oh, because they're in the... Magician? Su Chong. What? Tell him Su Chong. Su Chong. And how do you know that slant eyed wonder? You're his lab assistant. I'm his lab assistant. If it escaped your notice, Andrew Ryan sunk us 5,000 fathoms below his shining city. Booker's how does Su really Chong there. propose to get us back? That's between me. That's between me. And the slant. And the slant. But if I do this, the girl goes with me. Little sisters are worth their weight in gold. She's not up for negotiation. Last time I checked, Back in the city, they were making little sisters by the dozen. That's a right fairy tale you've dreamed up, sister. But if you're lying, we can just as well kill you tomorrow. Down here, we got nothing but time. In case I need to get hold of you. If you see Su Chong, tell him. Atlas says he hasn't forgotten him. What? Why? Why? Come on! Here, help us out, and let me punch you in the face. Elizabeth, come on, it's time to get moving. Booker? What? Over here, on the radio. You're not Booker. Well, of course I ain't. What have I gotten myself?
myself into. That's a bulky radio. I didn't orphan that girl. I didn't kidnap her. But she made for some exceptional bait, didn't she? I don't want to pick up the creepy doll head. Had to be done. Did it? I felt everything that every version of me felt. All of that knowledge. I lost a pinky. But that version of me, she lost everything. And Comstock, that final Comstock, he thought he could avoid his guilt by coming here. You educated him proper. But then why am I back here? Huh? I don't remember opening a tear to come back. And who are you? Huh? I think you'll figure that out soon enough. Oh, Reddit is going to just enjoy eating the fuck out of this game. <laughs> now, from I what I know... Mind? Now I was I'm talking. dealing with this Atlas, this, this psychopath. What was I thinking? I wasn't Paris any more than I am Booker. Now I have to find this, this Su Chong, and I don't even know who that is. Not yet, but you know he's the key, don't you? To what? You're asking me. Elizabeth, I ain't even here. <laughs> Thanks, Booker. Anyway, uh, I do know that this one is more heavily based on stealth versus action, which makes me very happy. Wasn't this the finale of the... Yeah, okay. Yeah, because that was the dead booker. Okay. Right, right, okay. So this is literally picking up right where it left off. Because that dead body was the dead... Comstock that you think is Booker that you play in episode one. See, I remember these things. Alright, I'll move the rubble in a minute. Oh, I guess I'll move it now. What are you? Huh? And how did you know exactly what to tell Atlas? I feel like yourself, Elizabeth. I feel... I feel strange and smaller. I, I can't see the doors. What's behind the doors? I, I can't see the future. I can't even see any tears. Oh my god. Stay away from me. Booker. No. No. No, please. Please don't. By that. Stay what? away from me! But then, how am I here? How can I be dead in this world and yet. My finger. She's got a pinky. I don't understand. I. I. If we're going to it's an alternate universe cross dressing booker. Are you being cute? to your way of thinking. Have you? Yes. I do believe one can change things, but after all the bother, one Wait, often what? wishes that one had not. You're a fatalist. A physicist. A fatalist. So was Newton, especially when it came to apples falling from trees. They always contrived to land with a splat. She left the child to rot. Are you implying she's the apple? I'm implying that she did not fall far from the tree. And now she wants to go back. I need to go back to fix what I broke. Back to where she has no right to be. Back to where she doesn't belong. Doesn't belong? Wait, what do you mean? Do you want to tell her brother, or shall I? Because I died. There are rules. Even for one such as you. She'll forget. All the doors. And what's behind all the doors. All close to what? her now. She'll be what? just Wait. like the rest of us. Forgetting the past. The present. The future. I'd wager she won't even remember this conversation. We've arrived. Well, she can just watch my videos, and then they'll be right there. So. 
What the shit is going on? Seriously. You're trading omniscience and croissants for death and mildew. I left Sally to rot. For what? So I could punish Comstock? He was trying to help her, to save her, and I... If I don't make that right... We all have our crosses to bear. But there is a thin line between a martyr and a fool. Oh. That lighthouse. Okay. Oh. Okay, now she doesn't have a pinky. The Lutesses warned me that if I came back here, I would collapse. Collapse? From a, a quantum superposition. Gesundheit. It's just me. Uh, quantum what? I've changed, Booker. No tears, no cosmic knowledge. Just a normal girl. With a normal pinky. Peter, it, if I can't open tears, I... I'm never leaving here, am I? I I'm never going back to Paris. I wasn't you, Paris. And you, you're just... You're, you're just what? You're, you're just the fragments of my memory telling me what my future holds? Yep. You decided to come here, Elizabeth. You knew what that meant. Only option, as I see it, is to trust yourself. Find Su Chong. All right. Well, this one starts off with a mind fuck if I've ever seen one. This is going to be a classic case of if I don't understand, I'll look up on Reddit. Man, I remember this scene in Metal Gear Solid. That was tough. Does that mean the ninja's going to show up? Or no, wait. I'm surrounded by guards in invisible cut. Never mind. All right, I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. Sorry. You spit rabbit. You spit right there. And you leave me what? That's not what you would have done. I'm not Booker. Just because your father did something one way doesn't mean you have to. All right. I come? Okay. She told me to stop calling, so I did. Now I just Ryan the Lion Preparatory Academy. I cleaned a bathroom. Did she even know? You'll want to get the drop on him. Be quiet. You can't hear what's only in your head. <laughs> He's not getting up anytime soon. And what with his head all attached to his body? From here on, it's only gonna get worse. Wait, and I have a skyhook? Is up to you. Oh, this is just what the world needs. It's up to us to Education by Andrew Ryan. Limits to how much we need for. 
Now, let's get his lockpick. Ooh, do we get a cool minigame? Lockpicking can be easy with the right tools and know-how. Use your lockpick to probe a pin. A neutral pin will open the door. A blue pin will open the door and knock free a noisemaker. A red pin will open the door, but also sound an alarm. Simple enough. Just a six-pin tumbler. Oh, but there's an alarm. Huh. That could come in handy, though. Okay. Cool, I think. Apparently I am a ghost, because I can walk right through a ball. What's in the vent? What? Wait, wasn't I just in here? Okay. Well, that's going to come in handy when there are other guys around, I suppose. Corner of shame. <laughs> what? <laughs> I will not share my toys. Alright guys, we are coming up on 28 minutes, so I'm actually going to go ahead and cut the first video here. Uh, this has been part one of my playthrough of Bioshock Infinite uh, DLC part two, Lost at Sea. Um, anyway, uh, we will see you back again soon with episode two. Guys, don't forget to check out my Facebook, facebook.com slash thecrankyoldgamer. Uh, check out my Twitter, crankyoldgamerx. And starting in the near future, I will be streaming once again, only not on uh, Twitch anymore, because Twitch sucks. Uh, I will now be streaming on Hitbox under the name The Cranky Old Gamer. Alright guys, we'll see you soon. Bye bye